Welcome to the University of Oklahoma. Of all the wild creatures on campus, none are as beloved as the fox squirrel. Referred to as the unofficial mascot of OU, the Sooner Squirrels have quite a reputation among students. Many incoming freshmen hear tales about how OU squirrels are imported from Arkansas and grumble about the supposed squirrel tax included with tuition. There are fox squirrels all over Oklahoma, but those on campus are different. They're not imported from another state, but are almost totally desensitized to humans from their interactions with students here. It's not your imagination. The squirrels on campus are a bit chubbier than those you might find elsewhere. That's because many Norman residents have made a habit of feeding them. Let's take a moment to meet some of those special squirrels. A family lives in this tree beside Kaufman Hall. The juveniles, now two or three months old, will soon be out on their own. This young boy scavenges, staying close to his home tree. One person he recognizes is former OU zoology professor Vic Hutchinson, who frequently feeds the squirrels on campus. This is my friend Daniel, and that's not his pet. He's been feeding wild squirrels on campus for years. Much like Vic, he only has to whistle for them to come out and greet him. This squirrel is named Nutty. She is a mother living in the trees of Crately Apartments. She loves being fed sunflower seeds. Pecans can also make for a very popular treat. And of course, they don't leave without a kiss. When the squirrels have had all they can eat, they look for a place to bury food for later. Squirrels return to their stashes in the winter, when food is sparse. They even organize their food supplies, so they can find the perfect nut when the craving hits. Squirrels have actually been known to pretend to bury nuts in order to confuse rivals who might rather steal than scavenge. Squirrels usually remember where they stashed their nuts, but not always. Every year, millions of trees are planted by squirrels forgetting where they hid their acorns. If a squirrel catches another thieving from their stash, or even just getting a little too close to a claimed tree, a chase is likely. Squirrels are vicious fighters, and many of them have torn or nicked ears from combat. When this rival oversteps his boundaries, the chase is on. While squirrels usually give chase because of territorial disputes, young squirrels will play chase one another, much like puppies and kittens. Male squirrels will chase females as a part of the mating ritual, often attempting to sniff their tails to assess fertility. Even though they may not be from Arkansas, I still think that our squirrels are pretty special. Just like people, each one has a unique life and personality. Some of them are friendly, some shy. There are loners and family squirrels. You really do find all kinds on campus. I hope that everyone can learn to appreciate our furry little friends, the squirrels of OU.